Hello everybody, and welcome back to Outer Worlds. The last part, I thought I was going to get that nav key, but nope. So I have the company's secret for the toothpaste. Or I know that they're making toothpaste. I gave it back to Anton because it didn't matter, apparently. Gladys didn't give me the fucking key. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go around Rosewood, Roseway. Find any secrets I can, bring them back to Gladys. I should mark it though, so I... Hopefully... How many scientists are there? This guy. You gonna tell me anything, dude? Another outlaw? I'm quite sure I've already spoken to your lot. I mean, you've spoken to me, specifically. I'm not an outlaw. Oh, quite right. My apologies. I did speak to you earlier, didn't I? Yes, you did. What would you like? Remind me who you are. I am Orson Shaw, Chief Behavioral Scientist. I was brought in to study the Raptodons. I was to ensure that, should a problem arise, our team is adequately equipped to deal with them. What'd you learn? They are insatiably hungry, absolutely impossible to control in any fashion, and indeed appear to be powered entirely by hate. No amount of studying will enable us to control them, or even slightly sate their aggression. So your research amounted to nothing? Not quite. We are now acutely aware of their weaknesses. Bullets through the head. Wow, just like everything else. Never would have thought of that. Now that may seem like an obvious conclusion, but believe it or not, some creatures' brains are not in their heads. Is it in their toes? Yeah, the yeah. Forgot I was here. Hey, focus. Oh, is that it? What does it look like? I'm preparing a personal defense device. Or trying to, anyway. Oh, I'm not sciencey enough. Need a hand? No. Uh, well, yes. Well, uh, no. Perhaps. I left schematics in our storage facility. As far as I know, the security commander hasn't found them yet. I admit I'd feel better were they returned to me. Sure, I'll see what I can find. Say, uh, you wouldn't happen to have a tube of thermal paste on you, would you? I don't think so. No. Blast. Well, good luck. I hope I see you back here in one piece. Me too. Okay. Maybe that's another secret I can get. Uh, is that... Where the thing would be? Probably. Let's go over there. Oh, it's a diet toothpaste. Uh, schematics, Gladys, Bond. Okay, schematics. Oh. Let's see, Let's see how well this works. He doesn't see me. Attack! Oh, fuck, that fucked him up. Come here, you. Ooh, I missed. Everyone all right? Did you hear a scream? Oh my god. Thank you for that. Where's the other guy's ashes? Damn it. That's what sucks about this weapon. It just burns them. That's a good week of work just to get the engine to turn over. You reckon that's how the bad guys got there? Sure. Probably. Oh, I didn't even realize this. Anything useful from it? Nope. I also really gotta stop playing this game at like the 40 minute mark or half hour mark because I just keep recording. Haha! Uh -huh. And I have like an hour of footage I have to go through and like cut out who knows how much. Good shot. Are there a lot more down? Oh, what is that thing? It's like a sawmill? All right, well, we don't need to go there, so let's keep going this way. I see you. <laughs> Missed it. Got it. You're the best there ever was. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what was that? Hold on, oh, he doesn't see me. He's an idiot. You would hear me coming, right? I'm not crouching or anything. And I'm in the heaviest armor there is. Ow. 
heard that, but I didn't really want to move. Oh, um, am I deaf now? All right, head to the facility. What's that? Heavy ammo, heavy ammo. How much ammo do I have now? That's a lot of ammo. Workbench. Anything I can break down. Now, apparently with this thing, I am a beast. So let's get the XP. Hello. Oh, he's still alive. Oh, there's a lot of them here. Okay, I wasn't actually expecting this money. Missed it. Oh boy, let's see how this does. I'm awesome. Even though I know I didn't do most of the damage to that guy. I love this weapon. It's going to be a shame when I get a better run. There's so many ash piles. That's the one thing I don't like about this. I have to like search for them. Is there nothing available there? What? Alright. Alright, let's go in. You see, you got a lot of numbers here. But you ain't telling me what they're for. Ooh, that's a lot of people. Terminal. Okay, a lot of messages here. I don't care. You could pause it. You could read it. Here's your lore, folks. Things are hairy out there. Lock the doors. Keep your head down. Stay safe. I'll come for you. God, there's so much notes. What is that? Stogie Slims. Nice one. Thank you. I'm surprised I didn't alert everybody else. Bag of tabacorn ears. Ew. Ew. It's like, why are there flies? Yeah! That would really suck if, like, when you level up, <laughs> they would just hear that and be like, What the fuck is that noise? <laughs> what were you looking at, wall? Is there anything I want? I should really look at it, this. I'm just gonna do two for now because I'm using that gun like, or weapon like crazy. Restricted items in the vending machine? Okay. Uh. All right, that's actually gonna cost a lot. All right, let's just do all that. Oh wait, did none of that save? Oops, there we go. And a perk. Perk, 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 perk. Sure. Does that mean I want them to kill more? I like killing. I don't even know how you can get a kitchen this dirty with just canned food. Uh, you could pee on some stuff. I'm taking all this stuff. I don't even know what it is. Like, every health item I have, I haven't even looked at. Vendor? I'll just say I'm my junk now. Still don't have anywhere close to 10,000. Um, what's this? If you need to get into the armory and don't have the code, ask me. If I'm not around, check the front desk at the bionics lab. Is this the lab? Also, is there an enemy here? It's probably above or below. No, this is a storage facility. All right, I'll just pick it. I don't feel like traveling back anywhere. Wow, nice work. Thank you. I'm that good. Uh, too many words. Too many words. If it's more than five words, I'm not interested. I also don't know why I'm crouching. Ooh, a revolver. I literally have, like, the heaviest armor I've ever seen. <laughs> and I'm crouching. This must be where Mr. Shaw's been working. Where? Oh. I was gonna say, where's all these bad guys? Okay, these are robots. I want to test out this gun. What's up, bitch? That works pretty good. Yeah, 
How does this work? Alright, that worked pretty well. So much stuff here. Precision, spectro, magnification, mono lens. Guessing that's a mod. Just guessing. Huh. Detailed drawings of an advanced pistol. Revisions and comments are scrawled across the image and mostly in eligible writing, except for the name Orson Shaw scribbled in the corner. Schematics depict a pistol from the brand name Force which is not native to the Halkin community. It's unclear from these plans what a f does. Okay. I got it. Should I take it back to Orson, though? Or can I... I mean, hell, I could probably give it to Gladys. Why are the two of you looking at me? Stop it. Okay, back to Orson. Do I not have this... I don't know where Orson is. There he is. Okay, found your thing. Pay me. Oh, hello. Oh my god, you're such a fucking idiot. <laughs> Why would I lie? For XP? Just give me the money. If you have any, please. Ah, yes. Very good. And have you done that? Got him right here. What a relief. You hold months of work in your hands. Hold on. Force weapons are contraband. Why didn't you turn this in when you found it? Anton would have just given them to Porter without a second thought. What a waste of potential that would have been. Well, I could persuade. These are valuable schematics. I could sell them for quite the profit. Hmm. Sadly true. Contraband does tend to fetch a high price among the colony's ne'er-do-wells. So be it. I'll buy them off of you. Yes! I have a buyer for these? No. Deal. Much obliged. Here are your bids. Now, let's see here. Attach this. Did you only give me a hundred? A little pressure and voila. I can finally call this little side project complete. Thank the law. Oh. Hmm. There we go. I can't be caught with this. Uh, you take it. If R&D buys the schematics from me, perhaps I'll get you the first model. Hot off the presses. I'll, uh call you? Yes, I'll call you. Do you have my number? So wait, what'd you give me? Did you give me a gun? I'm looking, I'm waiting for that thing to keep scrolling. Come on, I lost the schematics. Did I get a pistol? Increased? Okay, come on. Tell me, did I get a pistol? I know I can look, but I don't feel like it. Did I get it? Ooh, boy. Oh, it does the same damage as that, though. I don't want to get rid of that. Okay, I'll replace it with the pistol. Yes. The vermin. It's better damage. So if I just walk around with this out. Oh, wait a second. Is that a type of damage? Is it a burn damage or does it mean it's like illegal? Okay, I'm guessing it's burn because it says it has burn. Okay, I need about two more grand. Is there anything else here I could do? Uh, there was one guy, right? Vaughn? All right, I'll do his thing, then I'll go back to Gladys. Either I should have enough or She'll give it to me after, like, all the stuff I found out. Like the toothpaste, the illegal weapons. Okay. The hell's all that? Oh. You picked a hell of a day to visit. I'm Vaughn. Vaughn Cortez. Uh, Dr. Vaughn Cortez. But just Vaughn's fine. Really. Okay, Mr. Dr. Vaughn. How long have you lived here? Sure. I guess. Oh. I'm not supposed to talk to No, have you lived here long? I mean, why do you ask? Uh, do I care? Give me a mission. Hell if I know. There were a bunch of folks with guns and a lady yelling about wanting jobs or something. Next thing I knew, the Raptodons were loose. We've been cooped up in here, I don't know, hours? Too long. I have to get back to work. 
You look nervous. What? <laughs> uh, I mean, we're surrounded by hungry raptodons. Who wouldn't be? Am I right? Aren't they dead? Look, I don't want to go back out there, but there's a thing I gotta do. I had to leave an experiment running at the lab. Something I've been working on a long while. Something that could really get me ahead. Know what I mean? No. Details, please. I've been extracting organic compounds from raptodons. Compounds that have, um, benefits. Can you elaborate on that? Oh, slow down. Benefits? Felix, stay out of this. In certain social situations. Personal situations. Where you might want to, um, enhance your charisma. Oh, it's like Viagra. You gotta be more specific, Doc. Some people say rap must makes it easier to attract companionship. Makes you more, uh, appealing. So it's like a love serum? Uh, that's a big word. I don't know it, but does it work? The results are outside the margin of error. Technically. Okay, cut to the chase. Sure. Of course. Our lab's south of here, down the road. Not the old public lab. The one past that, built into the mountainside. Uh... Okay. And when I get there? My equipment's in the lower levels, way in the back. I have a big room all to myself. Dissection tables and whatnot. It should have been running this whole time. Just grab the results and bring them here. Alright, I'll keep an eye out there. Great! Uh, this is really gonna save my ass. The amateur alchemist. Is he an amateur? He made like a love serum or something. Could try it out on Felix. Charisma enhancing benefits he was talking about. He was just blowing smoke, right? Who knows? Maybe it'll be more attractive to me, Felix. You never know. How do I get out of here? Where am I? Am I stuck? Where's the exit? How do I leave this place? Oh. For some reason I thought I was in a building. Seems about as livable as a coffin. Well, I mean, look out here. Does it look more livable out here? Actually, wait, where are all those raptodons? Oh, yeah, there are. I was gonna say, did they clear them out? Is it the lab I've been to? Or no, it is that lab. Okay. I really should have accepted all... Okay, future self. Accept every quest in town before you head out. Probably won't, won't, won't matter because I cleared it all out. I don't think enemies will respawn here. Also, it would have been nice if I could have picked it up. Not knowing it was here. When I was here. I don't know if you could do that. Hey, how's it going? Get down to Roseway and talk to Doc Crane. We'll make sure you get what's yours. Oh, I already did. I'm just back to get something else. Don't worry, I'll be gone in a flash. Ah! Have I been here? No, I have not. Oh my gosh. This is please say we don't gotta walk through that. I mean I will because it looks interesting to me. Well, you could stay right there if you want. Oh, I don't have enough science. All right, hang on. I don't want to mess anything up here. Probably can't anyway, but who knows? Complete experiment. Okay, that was easy. Sweet. Was that it? Oh, I've got musk. Ooh. Can I put it on? <laughs> Probably a quest item, right? Oh, I can't put it on. More troop armor. For a second I thought it said you could break it down in the inventory. I don't know if you could do that, but it'd be pretty cool. Although I doubt it, because you still need a workbench. I thought that was a toothpaste for a second. <laughs> Wrap to prod? Okay. I'll examine all these, uh... Many of my items, even though I'm keeping that Reaper scythe on. It's a shock one. What's that? What's this damage? 118? Ooh. Ooh, that's a lot of damage. Actually, wait. Can I give you guys some weapons? Felix, what do you have? Yeah, boss? I know. I don't do it here, right? Uh, do it from here? Yeah. Tossball stick. Do I have a better one? 
And he's got the grenade launcher. You can keep that. Parati. She's got the impact and the pistol. Throw an auto mag. Okay. That's all I wanted to do. Hey, remember that girl in here, Cassandra? She thought I couldn't kill her? What an idiot. You see somebody roll up on you. Decked out in weapons. With two other people decked out in weapons. And you try to help convince them. Where am I? Try and convince them to help you. What an idiot. That was very quick. <laughs> Literally an in and out mission. I do wonder if you could have. You could probably bring all this stuff back to Gladys and sell it to her for like the exact same price, right? But I really don't care. You guys can keep doing your Anything? research. Who cares? On the thing we spoke about? You know, that thing? Oh, yeah, the thing. Your little uh, musk. Before that, I had a question. Lay it on me. You gonna pay me? Oh, never mind. Hey, whatever. Yeah, okay, here you go. Don't keep me in suspense. Did you get my stuff? I mean, not mine. It's for other parties. Buyers. Sure it is. This is gonna make me so popular. I mean, with the people who buy it. Not by using it. Because I'm not. Of course not. So, I really don't care if you're gonna use it or not. Uh, reward? Take this. You earned it. If you run into me again after all this is over, maybe I'll have more. Pleasure doing business. Yeah, hey, I'm friendly with, with Auntie Cleo. What'd you give me? Give me money? Keep scrolling. what I get? Okay. I think I either have enough or I'm like a few hundred away. Better days are coming. I can smell the money. Wait, no, that's Raptodon Musk. Hey, can I buy some of that off you? I really want to tempt Felix into uh, thinking some stuff. Oh, I'm 400 away. Okay, sell junk. Uh, let me go talk to Gladys. Because I imagine sh either she'll have like the rest of it after I tell her all the secrets, or I could just sell weapons at the place. Where's the exit? Here we go. Anyway, I think I'm done in... This place. I don't really care about that other thing I have to do. Uh, what was it? That's on Groundbreaker. Jameson? Who cares about him? He could find his own way out. Yeah, other than that, I'm done here. Okay. Back to Gladys. Back for a rest? Space adventuring is tiring work. I've acquired book. Hang on. What is book? When am I going to be able to use this? I really want to use this. I want to see what it does or even how to use it. What is book? Where's book? I doubt it would be an armor. Oh, that's a... That's a helmet thing? Oh, wait, if I put that on, we could see baby face. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that beautiful face. Hang on, that armor is kind of getting in the way. There he is. What does this do? Uh, plus five engineering. The best in safety wear for when you really want to protect your eyesight. Just one eye, though. Not the other one. So I know that has like the best armor, but I'm really not even using it that much. I'm not going in like a tank. I'm going in like stealth, like just smacking fools. I don't know if like light stuff makes you better. Or I don't know if like light stuff will make you walk faster. Also, I could sell these for a nice penny. That is plus five stealth. All right, let's go like, let's go with this for a while. Okay, off to Gladys. Oops. We've arrived at the groundbreaker. It's always so fast. Even though I know I'm not moving anywhere, it's just loading. Also, while I'm here, I could introduce you to Tennyson. I just... I just edited, um... The part where I first came to Groundbreaker and realized I unchecked bringing Parvati with me. I was like, oh! And then the rest of the video, I was like, where the fuck is Parvati? Yeah, and then I realized I'm a big dumb dumb. Room? For what? We have a ship. Okay, Gladys. Have you had a moment to look into that little opportunity I told you about on Roseway? I've explored it you thoroughly. Hurry up. Someone will get to snooping around there before you do. Okay, I investigated it. What's that? Speak up now. About those secrets you asked me to look for. What'd you turn up? First off, 
they are making toothpaste. I found the formula, then I unfound it. <laughs> well, that's just... Just swell, sweetheart. Good for you. You don't believe me, do you? And then, I found a prototype weapon schematic from Force, but I lost it. Bless your slippery little fingers. Isn't that just a shame? Prototype schematics go for a fair handful of bits around here. And then I acquired some research on Rapidon Musk, but I found another buyer. A shame you didn't visit old Gladys first. That would have fetched a good price. I may have thrown in a batch of my famous sugar cookies just to sweeten the deal. Damn it! If Auntie Cleo's exporting wraps from Monarch, golly me, someone's going to be in the soup when they get caught. Yeah, let them worry about it. All right, that's it. Darnation. It sounded like a gold mine, but maybe that's just my old hopes getting in the way. I suppose it can't be helped. Law bless you for doing the legwork, sweetie. Don't forget your pal Gladys now. You can come visit any time. All right. Oh, I have enough. How much did you pay me? Did you pay me? Hang on. Before I buy it. Anytime, sweet. How much? Ooh, just enough. This is gonna cost everything. All right. If you're here for this week's magazine club meeting, you're a touch late. If I gave her everything, I probably wouldn't have to buy it. But who cares? Fantastic. I'm not loading it back in. Do be careful with it, dear, as these keys tend to be a tad hard to acquire. Okay, thank you, Gladys. Lilia Hagen in the sublight offices. She's a dear. You'll love her. Now, was there anything else? I don't think so. Can I have some of those cookies? What do you want, then? My hard-earned wisdom? Cookie, 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 cookie. Nope. Anytime. No cookies. Who left? Oh, it's one of the sprats. Okay, Pervati. Hey boss, if you need a tour guide, I've seen all twelve episodes of Terror on Monarch. Kind of an expert. Okay. I'm gonna be able to set foot on a whole other planet. I know Monarch's a moon. I think it counts anyhow. I'll allow it. Okay, let's go meet Tennyson, or see you like freak out over meeting her. Excuse me, I've seen this I have seen this man. I have seen this man. Let me let me He wouldn't let me admit to him, I've seen him. Oh, it's still hot in here. Oh, Felix, take your clothes off. It's all pretty warm, though. And hot. All right, Pravati, here's Felix. Felix er, Millstone. No. Nice to see Pravati, you. here's Dr. Tennyson. Bay. Keeping your nose clean? Yes, ma'am. Been at least a couple weeks since my last nose-related incident. I have a uh -huh. big nose. I'm glad to see you in a captain's custody. Just try not to steal any critical parts from my ship. Uh, embrace your inner mis misfit. <laughs> I'll keep him honest. Don't know what you're talking about. I'm always honest around Ms. Tennyson. I'd tell you to stay out of trouble, but I know you'll find it anyway. Whatever you do, just make sure I don't find out. Provided you want to talk to June Lai, go ahead. What? I didn't think you just... Parvati, is it? That's a lovely name. What can I do for you? I was just thinking. I haven't got much experience working with actual... Real spaceships, Miss Junlei. Uh, uh, Chief Junlei. Junlei is fine. Keep going. Um, okay. Since you run a whole space station, I was wondering if... Well, maybe you could teach me some things. I could message you later, maybe? I'd be happy to make the time, Parvati. You can ask me anything. We're a nice woman. Uh, keep going. Wow, great. I I'll do that then. Messages. Later. Oh, your your name's pretty too. I should have said sorry. I like it. Honest. Sorry. You're blowing it. Nice job. Couldn't have done it without your moral support, Captain. Now, if there's nothing else, there are other parts of the ship begging for my attention. 
All right, uh, I have to do that thing for you, but I can do that another time. Now that I can actually leave. Peace. And leveled up. Um, I do want to pickpocket restricted items. Oh, hell yeah. All right, uh, I have all these now, right? Yeah, okay. Now, what else do I want? A lot of stuff for the companions. Uh, all right, let's get these to 20. These have to go to 40? Yeah. Uh, okay, let's try and get these to, up to 40 next. Okay. Wait, there's an elevator here? To back base. Felix, isn't that where you're from? Alright, well, who cares? Let's get back to the ship. Can you teleport there on this map? Oh my gosh, you can. Okay, last thing I want to do. Huh? Oh, <laughs> I am alert and awake. Not to worry. I take our ship's security highly seriously. Sure you do. Uh, I did say talk to Pravati back on the ship. Hey. Hey, Captain. Can I get your temperature on something real quick? You want to put something in my mouth? The ship about to blow up? What? No. If it were, I'd be hollering loud enough to wake the dead. So, June Lei and I have been talking some. Through messages? I got him here on my data pad, and well, she sent me a poem. One she wrote her own self, I'm pretty sure. I don't know if I should read into it. Because poems are all symbolic and such, right? It's not so good. But real sweet. How bad can it be? She rhymed compression alternator with aches to meet her. And that rhymes, doesn't it's it? It's about this engine her. that's been shaking itself apart. Then this lady mechanic comes by and lays one hand on it. And the trouble goes away. It sings. I don't want to get too hopeful, but I'm wondering if maybe she's the engine and I'm the lady? It's a real romantic poem. It made my chest hurt, kinda. Like you were gonna throw up? I don't know where it's leading yet, or if I'm misinterpreting. I'm not much interested in physical stuff. Never have been. Leastways, not like other folks seem to be. It's not that I can't. I just don't care for it. It's been a problem in the past. The folk who wanted to be with me back in the Vale, they didn't... They said I was cold. I like Parvati. She's nice. Thanks, Captain. That makes me feel a touch better. I actually had another message from June Lei. I just couldn't work up the courage to open it. But I'm going to change that. Right now. Okay. Here we go. Do it. Let's see here. Talking about old friends. Got to thinking... Isabel. Who's, who's Isabel? They were close, Captain. Like, more than friends close. Who's Isabel? I got perception. I don't know. June Lei talked about them like it was past, but how far in the past? Ten years? Last week? Birth. Captain, I'm feeling all mixed up right now. Could we maybe head to the Groundbreaker? Get some drinks at that bar there? Lost Hope? Oh, come on, Parvati. Next time we hit Groundbreaker, drinks are on me. Thanks, Captain. I'll be ready. Even though we're on Groundbreaker right now, we ain't going back. Alright, I'll do that another time. Um, oh, we're not on it. It's over there. It's too far. We'll go there another time. Okay, like I said, I want to keep these recordings under an hour for me so it's easier to edit. So I'm going to leave this one here. Thank you all for watching. Be sure to down below, leave a like, subscribe, share, and I'll see you all in the next part. Goodbye.